Let's talk about fringes. These frilly things that you see at the end of this garment with the blue ribbon. Let's talk about that. Holy Bible, let's get it. This is Numbers chapter 15 verses 37. And Yahweh spake unto Moses saying, Speak unto the children of Israel and bid them that they make them fringes in the borders of their garments throughout their generations and that they put upon the fringe of the border a ribbon of blue. So you're supposed to have a fringe upon your clothing with a ribbon of blue above it. And you are the children of Israel. The Most High wasn't talking to the whole world right here. Verses 39. And it shall be unto you for a fringe that ye may look upon it and remember all the commandments. So what is the fringe for? To remember all the commandments of Yahweh and do them. And that ye seek not after your own heart and your own eyes after which ye used to go a whoring. You know, oh, I don't need to follow the commandments. All I need to do is follow the ten. But yet you're only even following the ten. That ye may remember and do all my commandments and be holy unto your Elohim, I am Yahweh your Elohim, which brought you out of the land of Egypt to be your God. I am Yahweh your Elohim. So now we're going to get the strongs here for the color of the ribbon. Now it says blue, H8504. So blue, H8504. Seraline. Let's get that. So your ribbon can be in this color blue. Muscle. You know muscle? Muscle. So look at that purplish color on the muscle as well as blue. Look at it. The blue up there. And look at the purple right here. That is color violet. So this purple and the blue that I showed you before, those are the two colors that you can have your ribbon of blue in. So the ribbon of blue, this is also blue, but it is, this is a different form of blue. They just named it purple. Or should I say violet? This is Deuteronomy chapter 22 verse 11. Thou shalt not wear a garment of diverse sorts as of woolen and linen together. Why? To protect yourself from divination and magic. I did a video on that. Go watch it. Verse 12. Thou shalt make thee fringes upon the four quarters of thy vesture wherewith thou coverest thyself. So the next form of a fringe here is a zit zit. This is a zit zit. It's spelled T-Z-I-T. -I and then write that again. Zit zit. You put them on the corners of your vesture, each corner. Your clothing. My wife made me some of these. Blue, red, even yellow. Fringes to remind you to keep the commandments. When you're going to smack a guy in his face, you look at him and you don't bother smack him and walk away because he's your brother or your neighbor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep.